If you're in the market for a used car, be careful. Experts warn that almost a million Texas vehicles were damaged by Hurricane Harvey. And if you're not sure how exactly to spot one of these cars, well, you could end up buying one. Sunrise reporter Roland Rodriguez explains. There are more than 150,000 cars that received flood damage during Hurricane Harvey, and they are back, not only on Texas roads, but also right here in our own backyard. For South Texas, I don't know how many of them made it back down here, but they shipped a lot of them out. But it, at minimum of 10,000 between just South Texas area and Houston. Mechanic and owner of James Mathis Exxon says he has seen plenty of flood cars and knowing what to look for is key to avoiding getting ripped off. Mechanics need to know where to look for the problems on the car. And that goes back to pulling up door panels open, checking the oil, checking on the inside of the air cleaners, places where somebody's not going to as a normal look on a used car. Pulling the spare tires up, pulling the mats up underneath the carpet, looking underneath the seats. Any reputable place will know where to look. And when you get them off the ground, there's other areas that show up too. Many vehicles were totaled by insurance companies and sold for scrap and parts. Others were cleaned and repaired. Texas law allows flood cars to be resold as long as their history is disclosed to the buyer with a new title that labels it as damaged. The insurance company will total it and then they'll wholesale it out. When they wholesale it out, somebody can apply for a salvage title, get it running again and resell it. And that salvage title will say salvaged or rebuilt or whatever on there, but it won't be just a clean title. Buyer beware ever, so buyer beware. Experts say flood damaged cars that are sold instead of scrapped can have electrical, mechanical and even safety issues that can put your life at risk. If it didn't hurt the motor, there's a lot of electrical issues that can come from cars being in floodwaters. All right, if you want more information on this topic, you'll be able to find this story on our website, ChrisTV.com.